Good morning. My name is Ralph Friedrichs. I am an author, an addiction recovery coach, a life coach, and a host of this show, the Take Your Life Back Today radio show. You can see a video version of this if you go to YouTube under channel Take Your Life Back Today show. Beautiful day God has given us. I'd like to say a prayer for when you're tired of waiting, for whatever you might be waiting for. Let all that I am wait quietly before God, for my hope is in Him. He alone is my rock and my salvation, my fortress where I will not be shaken. My victory and honor come from God alone. He is my refuge, a rock where no enemy can reach me. O oh, my people, trust in Him at all times. Pour out your heart to Him, for God is our refuge. And that's in Psalm 62, 5 through 8. Friends, waiting is hard. And whether you're waiting in traffic, waiting for uh, the seasons to change, waiting for your husband or wife to get home from a work trip, or waiting for your dream to come true, waiting is never fun. I mean, seriously, who likes to wait? Who makes up and who wakes up and says, I hope I have to wait for something today? And if you're watching this and, and that's you, please call me at 844-405-HELP and let me know so uh, so that you and I, we can uh, exchange some stories. All joking aside, if the majority of the world could choose between waiting and not waiting, I think we choose the latter. Because chances are, if we are waiting for something, that means we want and we want it pretty bad. But we don't have it yet. Brothers and sisters, I don't know what you're waiting for right now, but I want to invite you to draw strength, not only from those who have waited for uh, before us, but from God himself. Draw strength from the promise of God and look forward to the fulfillment of those promises. For our God is not a God of false or empty promises, but of beautiful, certain promises. We are not alone when we wait. God, he is with us, and he wants us to pour our hearts out to him. He wants us to trust and find refuge in him. I pray that as we all wait, we will hold on to these truths, and we will let God's word renew our souls. Whatever he has for us is worth the wait. So, Lord you are not just the God of time, but the God of timing. Help us to trust you as we wait for the things we desperately want. Help us not become discouraged or depressed in this season of waiting, but help us take our place joyfully with all the saints who preserved through the wait you had for them. As we all walk through this season of Advent, help us to spend time meditating on, our pro on your promise to bring our Savior into the world. Thank you for your plan to come again and being restoration for all things. In Jesus' name we all pray. Amen. Call me at 844-405-HELP. Together we can help each other take our lives back. Be good to yourselves and be good to each other. Remember, a simple smile to anyone can change their day and even their life. For God so loved the world that he gave us his only son. How many of us parents and grandparents would give up our children for the sake of saving humanity? Well, God did it for us, did it for you, and did it for me. Let's praise him. Let's ask him for guidance and direction. And may God bless you on this beautiful Sunday. Take good care.